Hey guys, it's Sparkly Summer and welcome back to my channel. Um, in this video, I'm going to be doing a review <clears throat> on the new set that came out April 3rd, 2014 on the Sims 3 store. And may I say how much I freaking love this set. It is amazing and I have been waiting for something like this to come out for so long. You guys don't even know. I've been waiting for it to release, like, for the longest time. But, um, <clears throat> now that it's here, I went ahead and purchased it, and I was so excited to do this review for you guys. And, um, yeah, so I pretty much purchased the one, um, that's really up for sale right now. It is the one that costs 1,900 sim points. And I think it's like 19 to 20 dollars US dollars. And um, so it's, it is pretty affordable. So yeah. And most sets that come on to the Sims 3 store are around 19 to 20 dollars. Um, of course, that is a cost of like 1,900 sim points. But anyways, I went ahead and purchased it. And it does come with premium content. Um... And one of the premium contents that it comes with is the Baker's Station. And it says, and this is what it says about it. Um, make a wide, ver oh, <laughs> that's not it. Um, it's the good things come to those who bake. Indulge your sweet tooth with an exciting array of delicious new baking recipes. So it does come with new baking recipes, which is pretty neat. And then, uh, you have the, you have the deliciously, uh, oh no, that's not it. <laughs> well, there's, there's another one, um, it's actually, um, I don't know what it's called. It's kind of like a counter where, it's like a display counter type of thing. And it's really, really, uh, cool. So, <clears throat> this is the bakery that comes with this set. I think it is pretty darn neat if you ask me it's actually kind of like surrounded all the way across so i guess um either this would be your entrance this side or you can go ahead and uh kind of tilt it if um if you're on a corner such as that one over there um but i went ahead and set set this like that i, I should think i should have done I think you should have done it this way, but I guess either way works. Um, so I'm going to start showing showing you guys from the bottom up, and then, all right. So you pretty much have like three different baking stations, I guess you can say, or baking areas. So here you have the um <clears throat> baking area, and here right over here you have some display wedding cakes and you do get a new wedding cake which is pretty neat um it's the baked fresh wedding cake and you also have a birthday handcrafted birthday cake which you can make yourself now which is awesome um i do like the other birthday cake but i mean to have an extra one and uh, it's just awesome so i i really do love that and it's so cute um i like these uh you can actually view these I don't know, display breads in a pot or something. <laughs> and then you have like the this cookie dough in a jar, which is pretty neat, or bread, I'm or muffins. I'm not really sure what that is. Uh it's uh, well it's in Simlish, so I wouldn't be able to understand, but um here you have some pie, another wedding cake, and some more things right over here. So it's pretty much it for this area, I guess you can say. Uh you have a nice fireplace or not? I don't, I don't know um okay so here you have kind of like um some shelves <clears throat> such as you have in every other bakery area I guess you can say uh and if you ever walk into a Dunkin Donuts they are going to have these or any bakery really they should have these if not then they're just like shelves that you can choose something from and they should give it to you if not their stock up shelves uh which you can stock up it says <clears throat> the four interactions that you get here are set markup and you can do it for this item <clears throat> and there's full price low price and high price so pretty much it goes from low price full price to high price then you have the all sellable objects in the room and you can pretty much set the price for all the objects in this bakery or this room actually or on this entire lot so that's pretty neat you can browse you can set sale 
Ooh, you can actually have sales. That is pretty darn neat. Um, so you have the 10% discount, 25, 40, 15, 16, 75% discount. That is awesome. I was actually quite disappointed when The Sims 3 didn't come out with uh this like option for the toys that came with Midnight Hollow, but mm, it's okay. It's okay. So you can actually also purchase some <clears throat> oatmeal raisin cookies, sugar cookies, mom my thing right here my my comfort food my you, you can order an apple cobbler Ooh. uh why do you i honestly don't know i guess there are three apple cobblers i could be wrong um you can buy an apple pie peanut butter cookie <clears throat> you can buy a chocolate chip cookie and there is like um cupcakes over here you can buy life fruit pie and uh buy cupcakes too and we have some cinnamon rolls and some other nice treats here and these are the um <clears throat> the containers or uh display shelves i guess i was talking to you guys about which you can um purchase separately once the sale ends it's not really a sale um but whenever they uh put something on the sensory store they it comes with the purchase will come with uh usually with the premium with all the premium content so this is premium content and yeah i think it's pretty cool that they added that and that's pretty much it i guess you have some seating areas and then in the second floor uh, actually, no, I'm, I'm going to go over all of them. Um, and then here, it appears to me that it's kind of like a little cozier, I guess you can say. Um, smaller, definitely not as fancy, not as, you know, out there. But it is definitely so nice. Um, and it looks like here you kind of actually get some bread. Um, so here you have the sourdough. You have some wheat bread. You have some dinner rolls and pretty much like bread based things i guess you could say uh you have white bread so here is like where you sell the bread i guess here you have some a little bit of everything i guess and then over here which is really really nice i like this area a lot you have it's fr uh, yeah <laughs> it's actually really nice i like the paintings the seating um i like the fact that it's very bright uh and yeah so um, this is actually the baker's oven, which is a pre the um, one of the premium content items that comes with this uh, set. So right now it is really nice. Uh, you can actually serve, and you can serve deep dish cobbler, some pie, some bread, cake, cookies, and other desserts, uh, such as cinnamon rolls and cupcakes and. Under the deep dish cobbler, you have some apple cobbler, blueberry cobbler, cherry, pear, plasma, plum, raspberry, and strawberry cobbler. Now, I am going to warn you guys that you do need to have um, ambitions late nights, uh, ambitions late nights, the, the oven <laughs> that, I, uh, that I believe comes with uh, Monte Vista. And you also need to have uh, the Bohemian Garden if you want to have all the dishes. Um, and yeah, such as, you know, for example, you have the pl uh, the plasma cobbler, which would come, the plasma would come from um, late night. So mm, there you go. And some blueberry, raspberry, things like that do come with the, and strawberry come with the, um, the Bohemian Garden set or the Harvestables. And you also have chocolate pie. And that's another thing. And pecan pie. And there's just so many things that you can have by purchasing the the Harvestables. So we can make some white bread, some dinner rolls. Uh, why can't we make this? Ooh, we need a cooking skill. So we can make all kinds of bread, rye bread, birthday cake, and wedding cake. And then... uh. We can make some cookies, some sugar cookies, chocolate chip, oatmeal raisin, peanut butter cookies. And yeah, that's pretty much it for that interaction. Um, and there is one move that you get, uh, which is Mama's, just like Mama used to make it. And it's really, really neat. I also do like the interaction thumbnail, which is nice. So I think we could actually uh, try this out right now. Um, oh, and this does come with... Um, this set does come with this nice little 
um, cashier, which is pretty neat. Uh, and you, w- what you can do is you can browse, obviously, attend, check sales performance, and that'll show up right here. You can fire Sherry Roberts. Okay, let's fire her. And then you can actually hire a sales clerk. Uh, We can set hours from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m., which seems to be the best uh, choice right now. Uh, You have the 3 uh, 3 p.m. to 1 a.m. and then 11 a.m. to 9 p.m. So um, I think those are some pretty, pretty good hours, I guess. (laughs) And um, so I'm going to have our sim, which is Penny Walsh. Go ahead and serve some apple cobbler. Ooh, yummy. I want to see this. All right, so uh, you guys are going to get the first look animations. Not the first look, but you're going to see what the animations are like. And she is my latest greatest Sim Sim, so I think that's pretty neat. So you have some butter, some eggs, milk, you know, the basics, making some nice pastries. So I'm going to quickly put this on speed one, I guess. She's just making that. And from looking at other reviews or just one other one, I have seen that all the animations are pretty much the same when making things here in the baker's oven. So, yeah, that's pretty neat. All right, so let's, let's speed through that right now. Let's see. When are they going to be ready for us? All right, so it's ready. It's served on a regular dish. Let's take a look at that. That looks pretty good, if you ask me. And it, all, it is also a uh, normal quality. So let's go ahead and grab a plate of that because she's a, a little bit hungry. So we're going to see if we get that nice interaction. All right. And she, I did put on some uh, aprons on her, and I think that's... It's really cute and this nice headband which is custom content it's it's really nice honestly it is oh and here is the mood that just like mom mom used to make it or just like mom used to make i love the smell of fresh break fresh baked bread in the morning and that gives you a plus 20 mood and a and this lasts for four hours and as you guys can see it is a pretty neat looking mood that item so i'm actually going to have her come here and um tend this and see if we have anyone purchase that um okay let me do something real quick testing cheats testing cheats enabled enabled true oh i'm such a terrible typer um teleport me here no oh, okay she can tend it apparently um so let's see if actually anyone comes um, i guess i'll just speed through this i will no no one's showing up no one wants to see no one wants to have any nice pastries well we are in evansville county so i would understand that um So, uh, I'm actually going to continue reviewing uh, the upstairs area. Alrighty, so starting from over here, we have a nice little kitchen, which looks as if you can actually um, prepare some things here. And you have a nice little working area, I guess you can say, for making the, the cake. And I am going to show off that interaction now to... Um, so here you also have some sitting areas, a nice little chimney here or a fireplace actually. Um, and then here above the bread bakery area, I guess you could say, you have a nice kitchen and it is pretty darn neat, nice and cozy and woody like and cabin like, I like it. It's very nice and pizza parlor looking. And then uh, here you have some more seating areas, which is pretty nice. And then in the third floor, you have some bathrooms, which is which is always handy. Uh, you have a living area and then some bars or yeah, you have a nice bar over here and some places to sit. Uh, you have a nice office area here, I guess, to research. You have some storage over here. You can stock this up, actually. So let's... Um, this item i guess we can't stock up but it's okay uh so yeah this seems to be this little work area um, above the pizza parlor looking place Ooh, and this one's so cute this one's so so cute i love it i love it i love it um so you seem to have like a little closet over here a desk for researching i guess and 
um, a bookshelf too, so for some books, I guess. Some cookbooks. You have some more storage over here. A nice living room area where you can sit down and just chill and read your books and yeah. So over here, oh, well, we already went over that. Oh. <laughs> All right, so that is pretty much it um, for the overview of the entire bakery. But I'm actually going to have her go ahead and uh, have her put away the leftovers. And then I will have her uh, serve some birthday cake. Ooh, that's going to be nice. That's going to be real nice. I'm really, really, really excited. So let's go ahead and hire sales clerk. Because why not? All right. And I do definitely see myself using this in the future with my uh, future gameplays as well. So I think it, it'll be really nice for some extra cash, I guess, um, to just have a shop. But obviously, this one is not going to be affordable because it is like three, four, 345,000 18 simoleons. <laughs> that is not fun. It is not. So can we not put these away? Oh, we have to cook that first or bake it first. So let's just speed through that speed. Ooh, here it is. That looks just... Honestly, that looks exactly like my cake. Ah, look at this. Look at this. I love it. I love it. I love it. I, I just love how she made it. Um, So I guess that's it. I guess that's it for the cake. Um, So you can also blow out the candles, which is pretty nice. And yeah, that is pretty much it for this review. I hope you guys enjoyed it and all its great things. If you were to ask me if this is worth the money, I say definitely go for it. It comes with so much. It has so much to offer, especially if you have the Bohemian Garden uh, Harvestables and um, Late Night and Ambitions and the the oven <laughs> that comes with Monte Vista or the roasting oven I honestly I, I'm sorry guys my mind is somewhere else right now but um yeah so if you were to ask me if it's worth the money it is definitely worth every penny I'm so happy I actually purchased this I, I cannot be happier so yeah I really hope you guys enjoyed this review be sure to thumbs the video up if you enjoyed it and I will talk to you guys very soon bye guys